the asylum. The asylum, or just known as Asylum, or Rushing Falls Asylum according to this sign, is an escape the room game where it's basically your entire fault because you enter the asylum. Uh, there's zombies around most corners and you have to use headphones to uh, escape. Now, I, I hesitate with headphones because it's actually not that easy to tell where the sound's coming. So here's the story. The abandoned asylum has been the home to many bizarre experiments over its 100 year history. Even though the asylum has been long de deserted, uh, something still remains, something sinister. Oh, can't wait to see that. You must use your senses to their fullest to make it out alive. Keep a lookout for clues in secret areas. What did that say? I can't even see what that says down there. Button with random words. Okay, so if we click the button, we're going to enter the asylum. <gasps> Here we are. Beautiful mint green walls. And a f nice looking door there. Okay, I heard noise. All right, so let's let's try it right. Oh no! I was eaten by a zombie in a t-shirt. Right, so, so the worst part about this is, if you do get game over, you have to start the entire intro sequence again. Okay, so the goal is not to be eaten by by the like teenage zombies. All right. And let's go. Now let's see if we can tell which direction the sound was coming from. Because that indicates which way you have to go. Okay, I didn't hear anything, so I know to go left. Okay, that one was... That way, I think, was coming from the left and right. So we'll try right. Aha! Right, um... <gasps> what? Oh, ho, ho. I found a secret. <clears throat> oh! Alright. You got the hip-hop zombie. <laughs> Alright, this zombie's going to Jamaica. It's like a game show. I think I won Jamaica as a cash prize. What a trip. Like Wheel of Fortune. <clears throat> I mean, at least there's some animation. A couple frames are it's still animation and <laughs> weird cropping. <laughs> how, do I, how do I end this? How did I die? Was it his? Was it the jaunty tune or the, or the dancing? Huh. Why are there random holes in the sign? I've got questions. All right, let's try this one more time. The problem is you have to wait for all the noises to stop. So it's just another thing that you can't skip past. Alright, so it was left. Also, there's blood here. Why would you even think to go this way? Alright, right. I, I, I can't tell. It's not the bookshelf. We'll go right again. Okay. All right, I think we're making progress. We've we, we've hit a cutscene, and what a glorious cutscene it is! All right, um, do I? Do I okay, click the light. You know what? I've had good luck going right. Let's keep going right. <gasps> oh no! I heard. I saw that. You know, if he went that way, I'm gonna keep going right. Wait, there's other people in here? You know what? I'm still going right. <gasps> Wait, what? What? What's going on? 
Oh, why is he back here? Why is he back there now? Oh no, he's right here now. Did I lose? Um. <laughs> the creatures within. Uh oh. Oh, I have a gun now. Alright, shooting the heads doesn't seem to do anything. How long do I have a gun for? The zombie should have posed no problem. Okay, so it seems like it's on loop, and I don't think the blob hurts us. So... Okay, let's shoot the fan. Now, how does that work? <coughs> Excuse me. So... All right. I'm going to have to take the song out, probably. <laughs> all right, here's all of our friends photoshopped. <clears throat> like one of their names, at least. And their taste in music. Oh, there they are again. So it was just the same three over and over, huh? Oh, good job, Dan. That's this beautiful art. Audio. Silent Hill Phantom Manor and fla on flashkit.com. All right. <coughs> Screw entertainment. <coughs> These guys are rebels. All right. Is there a post credit sequence or scene? No, I'll just play again. Maybe I'll go through and <laughs> try to see all the deaths, but I'm not going to do that in this, this video. <laughs> all right, so author comments. Behold, my first Flash game, Asylum. It's a first-person survival horror game. You do have a gun in the game, but you can only use it on the boss. So, like, why? Excuse the file size, but I need it to have some good sound quality because the game... I assume that means relies on your senses... So if you hear a noise on the right, go left or you'll die. But I didn't I didn't get that. There's there wasn't a lot of no Oh my god, it's a lot of that's a lot of people's comments here. <laughs> First time I saw the monster, I had to stop myself from laughing. Amen to that. Uh let's let's see score and what's the last page? Let me see some of the more critical things. Sick balls. Maybe it's my hearing, but it, if I hear the noise on the right and I go to the right, to not get eaten by zombies. Yeah, I mean, that's 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 what happened. The zombies weren't zombies. Uh, it wasn't good. You know, let's go back to the let's go back to the five stars. Uh, okay, Nightblade Hawk, ten out of ten. This was really good, but your senses not can ever see the danger. And that part with the two doors, I saw the blood on the right and think there will be one I go to the door in the middle and get killed by a zombie and the part where you see a monster going left you must really have good senses or you get killed by it and the boss was too easy you must only shoot the th shot the oh my god this guy's grammar make another of it so so the game's terrible but I want a sequel five out of five <laughs> alright great game need it to be longer I don't think it need to be longer it just need it to be better no offense. Awesome. ACDC. Yeah. Man, that was awesome. <laughs> what? All right. Um, Dan the man, this game is your first. Well, it is awesome. It scared the. It scared him in 2006? Wow. That's pretty, that's pretty bad if it scared him. Oops, come on up too far. Uh, I will now have that Limbo song stuck in my head for the rest of the eternity. Okay. Five out of five. Oh, oh actually, let's just go back to Cyrix 311. So aside from that, this was a great game. The graphics and sound were excellent. Everything played through smoothly. The only complaint I have is that it was a little short, and the plot was sort of weak. But other than that, this is one of the best games I've seen on Newgrounds. Five out of five. <laughs> so your green your green face paints good and the sounds were great that you took from another site 
Uh, but everything else, too short, and the plot was awful. Five out of five. <laughs> All right. Uh, Kulu. Good. Can you please tell me something? How do you make games? I mean, if you press an arrow, you come to the left. If you press one another arrow, you come to the right. How did you make it? <laughs> what? P.S. Good game. Ah, uh, goodness. Let's go back up to the top. I probably won't go through too many of these. There's too many. Um, did I go backwards? No. Oh. <laughs> nice sound. I feel like I was playing Silent Hill. Well, <laughs> there's a reason. All right. Well, everyone, that was The Asylum. Hope you enjoyed. Hey, all Thanks for making it this far in the video. Please remember to like and subscribe if you're enjoying the content. Now, on to part two of this flashback video. So I made mention at the end of the Asylum video that I wouldn't be uh, recording the death scenes during the video, and that's true. I'm doing post-commentary. So let's give it a look-see. Here's all of the deaths for the Flash game Asylum. Starting from the very beginning, going to the end. And also the bonus one. All right, so our very first one, and we saw this in the video. Um, we click right. right yep. And we have our first green person. All right, so tasteful crossfade. We have three choices in this room. So I feel like they should have done for more rooms. Would have, you know, extended the gameplay a little bit. So we're going to choose left first. So at least they did some different animations. I mean, that's good. Alright, so this time we're going to click the up button. <laughs> One thing I forgot to mention when we're looking at comments is that Asylum actually won Daily Third back in 2001. This won an award. That's crazy. All right, so in this one, of course, we have the bookshelf, but if you go left, you encounter another zombie. A slow guy. All right, so we'll click on the light. So you move on to the next room. <laughs> and get our next one. It's the guy with the spinny head again, but this time, it's deadly. So we're almost near the end now. So this is a repeat. I guess they figure people wouldn't be looking at all the deaths. Right, here's the one right before the boss. So this one has a hint for the boss though. It says death, death from above or something. So it gives you a little hint if you die there, which is nice. And then last, we have our favorite one. The dancing one. Oh, and apparently if you click the bookshelf multiple times, it resets the uh, the motion. <laughs> of course, it doesn't reset the arrow, so you can't save yourself. It's probably my favorite one out of the, the whole group. In fact, I don't think I've seen the zombie, this character, in throughout the hallways, but I don't remember. Even though I just looked at it, I don't remember. <laughs> so much fun. I hate to, hate to interrupt him. <laughs> Alright, clap your hands, it's party time. And that was all the deaths in Asylum. Hope you enjoyed.